Hi everyone, today I'm going to be talking about red flags when it comes to narcissists. Now I was speaking to another lady who's been hit by a narcissist, another girl who's on TikTok and we were just going back and forth talking about red flags and the main one red flag that we didn't know about was giving the narcissist money. I'm not sure whether it's because where we were brought up in terms of London or maybe how we was brought up but we didn't see giving a man money as a red flag because we know that you know especially in our communities that sometimes we just need a helping hand sometimes you might lose your job or you don't get paid yet not everybody always has money all the time right so if a man comes to us and asks us for money we're not going to see that as a red flag we're not going to see that as he's using us how if it's abuse we're not going to see it that way we're going to think, OK, the same way as us as women may ask our men for money, it's, comp- it's exactly equal, right? Like if I ask you for money to help, you, to help me pay for my rent, it's not that bad if you ask me for money, OK? But when we actually go down and deep into it and we realise how much money the narcissist has actually robbed from us because they don't pay you back, how much money the narcissist has actually robbed from us, we realise, damn, it's a red flag because they actually test the waters first of all first it starts off with little bits of cash like a tenner just borrow me a tenner so i can you know fill up my petrol or whatever the situation is then it gets higher and higher before you know it you're giving thousands of pounds to the narcissist like you don't even have thousands of pounds you don't even know where you're getting the thousands of pounds from but you're giving it to the narcissist right then they start to use you and abuse you and then when they mess you over because they're going to they're gonna cheat or lie or just discard you you feel like crap and the thing is you're gonna feel like crap anyway but when you're given a man thousands of thousands of pounds throughout a long period of time and then you find out he's got baby mothers all over the place or he's married or he's gay or whatever the situation is you find out that he's not who he says he is it hurts because it was just the one red flag he asks you for money because when i got hit by the second narcissist he asked me for money very early on and at that point cut off because I knew. But if you don't know, I'm telling you here, one of the red flags that somebody is going to use you or is a narcissist or is a toxic person is they're going to ask you for money. A man is going to ask you for money. And if that man really likes you and is trying to impress you, he will ask everybody else before he asks you because he doesn't want you to know that he's broke. So that's a major, major red flag.